Adam, I was a bit surprised when you told me that you want to talk about drug stocks to watch ahead of the big cancer research conference, the ASCO conference. I thought ASCO took place in June. It's only March. So are we a little bit early here or what? You know, Greg, surprisingly, we're not early. Um, you know, I realize we're just sort of getting to the end of winter, um, but now is the time that we, you know, we should start compiling a list of drug and biotech stocks that are likely to move as we get closer to the big ASCO, uh, ASCO conference. Um, you know, I've already received my first ASCO party invitation, and I booked my hotel room for the conference, so I'm definitely starting to think about it. All right, so which stocks make your early ASCO list? You know, honestly, my ASCO stock list right now, it's a bit thin, um, but I expect that to change as we get closer to the event. Uh, right now, I'd say the drug stock with the most potential upside or downside here is Celdex Therapeutics. Now, it's going to use the big stage at ASCO to release some mid-stage uh, data on a breast cancer drug. Now, Celdex is small enough that positive data could really move the stock higher. What else are you looking at? You know, I'd, I'd pay attention to Ariad Pharmaceuticals. They're going to have some important clinical update on its leukemia drug, Pinatinib. Um, Avail Pharmaceuticals is also going to use ASCO for a uh, full data presentation on an important drug to treat kidney cancer. And then, and then just on Thursday, Johnson & Johnson put out some preliminary data on its prostate cancer drug, Zytiga, which is going to be a big headliner uh, at the meeting. All right, so we're going to be speaking about ASCO stocks for the next few weeks. It's going to be a big thing. Yeah, absolutely. You know, ASCO is it's, it's the most closely watched cancer conference out there, and it's definitely one of the key drivers of biotech and drug stocks as we move into the spring. This market is stock pickers market. Stocks have rallied this year. We're coming into a Monday where we're getting.